Hello everybody, we are currently at Walmart. It is completely full of snow if you guys can kind of see it. No, but anyways, they canceled school today. They shouldn't have, the roads are completely 100% fine, but we had a lot of rain yesterday and then a lot of snow. So I have both children with me today. Yeah, so I prom I said kids can we get out of here in an hour can we please get out of here in one hour So we are gonna see what happens if we can get out of here in one hour But I currently have 16 rebates that I need to get for that snowman bonus to get $15 So challenge accepted we're gonna do that and then I need I think 10 rebates to get the weekend warrior for $1 we're obviously gonna hit that. So let's go inside and have some fun shopping. Let's hope these guys are good children today. And let's go have some fun shopping at Walmart. So here's a deal that we can do. It is the Vita Fusion Multi Vites for $5.98. You're gonna buy two of them. You would pay $11.96. But we have an Ibotta deal where you get $2 back with a limit of five, so you get $4 back with Ibotta. And when you buy two of them with swag bucks, you get 600 points, so $6 back. Making these just $1.96 or 98 cents each. So my store has one more left of this Ivisa for $8.97. I went and printed it off the $5 off coupon from the Ivisa website. You would pay $3.97, but then there is an Ibotta deal for $3 back, making this just $0.97. Cents. So here we have the first aid band-aids first aid kit for $2.38. You would pay $2.38 for it, but we currently have $1.50 back that you get back with Ibotta, making this just $0.88. Cents. Perfect little thing if you need to get that. Now, I did this deal last week where there was a better deal with the Fetch Rewards, but my Fetch Rewards did not reset, so we're going to get the liners for $2.97. You would pay $2.97 for it, but then there is an Ibotta rebate for $2.00 back, making this just $0.97. Cents. So here's an awesome deal on this Slow Meg MG. It is $9.88. Now I currently have a Shopkick deal where you get 1,115 points, which is $4.46 back with that. And then there's also an Ibotta deal where you get $4.94 back with this. This just comes out to be just 48 cents. So here we got, I got a tight fit you guys, but here we have these soft soap. Soap. The refills for $5.97. You're gonna pay $5.97 for it. Thank you, Help Urban. But with the Shopkick app, you get 710 kicks, which is $2.84. And then with Ibotta, you get a dollar back with that, making the big bottle just $2.13. I'm sorry you guys, but look at this. Oh my gosh, hello childhood. This is so adorable. It's not worth 20 bucks for me. I'll wait till it goes on clearance, but that is so cute. So if you need some little gifts for your pets, we have the little slurp prizes, or we also have the little shakes. These are $1.24. You're gonna buy two of the little shakes or two of the little slurp prizes. You will end up paying just $2.48. But we have an Ibotta deal where you get $1.25 back when you buy two for the little slurp prizes or the little shakes. So each of these come out, or two of these come out to be $1.32 or $1.23 or $0.62 cents each. So here's an awesome deal that you guys can get for the Lysol laundry sanitizers. They are $6.97. You're actually going to buy four of them. So... Yes, you're gonna buy four of them for $6.96. Charlotte, please. Altogether, you will pay $27.88. But when you spend $20 or more, you get $3.50 back with um, with uh, Fetch Rewards. Sorry, it got super loud all of a sudden. You'll get $1.50 back times four with Ibotta. So that is $6 back with Ibotta and you get 800 kicks. It is a limited two that you guys can do in the same thing. So you get $16 back with swag bucks. Plus, you guys can also submit your receipt to the coupons.com app 
I actually have two of the Lysol's uh, sanitizers for $1.50 and I also will get a dollar back when I buy two of these Lysol products. So this all together comes out to be a dollar and sorry I lost my spot a dollar and 62 cent money maker for buying four items awesome deal so here we have the Clorox mist my store is sold out of uh, multiple of the refills so I'm gonna show you guys two different scenarios so if you get the mist you're gonna buy two of them you're gonna end up paying just ten dollars and fifty six cents but then you're gonna submit your receipt to the coupons.com app for two dollars back plus we have a deal where you get two dollars back times two with ibotta so you get four dollars back with ibotta and if you buy two it has to be one or the other you can't buy one of each so if you're going to buy two of the refills you actually get 300 swag bucks making it just a dollar 56 but then we have this deal that you might be able to get for a 600 point bonus so this could be for the ref the mist refill could be a four dollar and 44 cent money maker if your store has two of the mist but since my store doesn't we're going to get two of the regular ones for 682 you'll pop you'll buy two of them for 1364 you'll get that 600 swag bucks you'll get the 300 swag bucks you'll get the two dollar or four dollars back with ibotta and the two dollars you can submit to um uh coupons.com so either it'll be four dollars and 64 cents or a dollar 36 cent money maker but i will let you know in my breakdowns so here we have the chobani oat milk for three dollars and 98 cents we actually have some shop kick deals where you get 400 kicks for purchasing and scanning the product along with a dollar 50 but we're going to come with um fetch uh, with ibotta we're going to combine it with another deal Okay, so here we have the Chobani Zero Sugar uh, Yogurt for $1.38. You're gonna buy two of them, and you're gonna also buy that yogurt, that milk. You're gonna end up paying just $6.74, but with Shopkicks, you get 75 points, which is 30 cents with Shopkicks, and then you guys will get also $1.22 off of two with Ibotta. You'll get that 350 kicks plus 50 kicks, which is $1.60 with Shopkick, along with the $1.50. When you buy two of them, you get a bonus for 200 points on Shopkicks, which is 80 cents. So the three of these come out to be just $1.32 or 44 cents each. Here we have some Ritz crackers for $3.88. My kids love these crackers. But we currently have two Ibotta rebates that you guys can do. We have a dollar twenty-five, and there is a ten cent any cracker rebate. So you just pay three eighty-eight, you get those two rebates. Comes out to be two dollars and fifty-three cents. So here we have the Hungry Jack uh, pancake mix for two dollars and seventy-seven cents. You're going to pay two seventy-seven for it, but you can submit your receipt for a dollar with coupons.com and submit your receipt to Ibotta for a dollar making that box just 77 cents. We also have the Pearl Million Pancakes for $2.94. You get an 85 cent rebate with the pancake mix and then we have the syrup for $2.47 or $3.47 but you get a dollar rebate with the syrup on um, Ibotta. And you also get a dollar back with Fetch Rewards for the syrup. You also want to submit your receipt to Ibotta or to the coupons.com app and you get a dollar off of two. Making your final price, so you guys would pay $6.41 for those two items. You'll get the dollar back and the 85 cents back, plus the dollar back and the dollar back from coupons.com. Your final total comes to just $2.56 or $1.28 for breakfast. If you need a pasta dish, we have the pasta roni for $1.22. You would pay $1.22 for it. But then we have a 50 cent rebate with Ibotta, making your final price for this just 72 cents. Here's an easy meal if you guys want to go ahead and do this. So we have the Cheetos macaroni and cheese for $1.38. You would pay $1.38 for it. But then there is a 75 cent rebate with Ibotta. 
making this just 63 cents. So a pretty good deal for 63 cents. We also have the Rice-A-Roni, the San Francisco treat for $1.22. You would pay $1.22, but then there's that 50 cent rebate with Ibotta, making this just 72 cents. Welcome back to my channel. Yes, I'm here to share with you guys my Walmart I bought a haul. I cannot believe it, you guys. My kids, my kids, like you would hear them in the background a little bit, but my kids were actually pretty decent the whole time. I heard a couple times I was bored, but you know what? I gotta give them a round of applause. They actually were pretty good. And then I'm like, okay, you guys, we're almost done, we're almost done, and bam, like they were perfect. I couldn't believe it. We got out of the store in like an hour and a half, an hour and a half, so that was awesome. But I'm here to share with you guys everything that I got at Walmart. So everything that I showed you, I got. Um, I didn't have any problems. I only had just that one $5 off printable coupon that I used, so I ended up getting that. My total, came to be a hundred and seven dollars and twenty three cents a hundred and seven twenty three is what it came out to be for all of that stuff now I always roll my gift cards between like fetch rewards swag bucks uh, shop kicks and uh, Ibotta I'm always rolling my gift cards especially for Walmart so I never pay for my haul ever like I just kind of well I may be do but I kind of like you know just continue rolling those gift cards um so, with Ibotta, I received $37.61. I didn't get a chance to check out how many rebates it was. I needed, um, I know I needed 16 rebates, which I think I maybe got 19 or 20 rebates, um, all together. But, uh, Walmart, I bought has been really wonky lately. Like you get your money, but you don't get a notification that you get it right away. Like I have to go back where it says like on the top right corner, it says you earned cash. Like I got to click that and then I got to click on my earnings and then it shows it up. And then lately I've been getting emails like a week or a week or a few days after I already redeemed the, I bought a rebate. So I already got the money for it. It's just, they're really behind on sending emails. Um, so that's okay. If I get, if I'm late, I get in an email. As long as I got like my cash right away and it shows right there, I'm totally fine with that. With Fetch Rewards, I received 4,810 points, which is $4.81. With Swagbucks, I received 2,813 points, which is $28.13. Shop kicks, I received 2,500 kicks all together. 2,500 kicks, that's $10. $10 I received back from Shopkick. I did receive $8 back from coupons.com. I submitted my receipt for the th uh, three Lysol sanitizers. Uh, there was the $1.50, the $1.50, and the dollar off of two. And then the Clorox Mist, the Pearl Milling, the Hungry Jack, and then I was going to get that Chlorolon, Chlorolon, whatever. I kept scanning the product while I was at the store. And the digital, uh, the iCoupons.com was not, like it said it didn't, it didn't exist. It wasn't working. And so I just did not get it because it said it was for like a 22 ounce and the bottle that I had was a 32 ounce. So I was going to get that deal. It would have been a great deal, but my store didn't, or the thing wasn't working correctly. I did finish the weekend warrior bonus for a dollar. What? What? Give me that dollar. I did receive a 25 cent Lysol bonus. I know after three different purchases, you get a bonus. So I hit that with a 25 cent bonus. I did finish the Clorox bonus for 75 cents. There was a Friskies bonus that I did not know about, but I got 25 cents with that. Um, you just had to buy two of the cat food items. I did finish the Frosty Fun. Now, last weekend I was at the store. It popped up while I was checking out, and I'm like, sure, let's choose 50 rebates for $15. And I thought, yeah, I could do it. I could do it. And then little did I know I had, like, literally a week to do it. So I decided, oh, we'll do it. And then when I went grocery shopping the other day, I actually got some I bought a rebates on my groceries. So I only needed 16 rebates, so I did hit that. So I got a $15 I bought a bonus rebate and my items came out to be a dollar forty three. I got twenty seven items for a dollar forty three. That's five cents each. Um, my total before coupons was one hundred and twelve twenty three. So I saved 
$110.80. I saved $110.80. That is awesome. That is awesome. It really pays to stack on those apps if you guys haven't done that already. But I'm pretty excited with everything that I got. Make sure you guys give this video a great big thumbs up. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you guys. We will see next week being it so close to Christmas, and my kids are out of school. I may or may not do a uh, Walmart I bought a haul. I know the store was really busy today. Like, I get there, and the parking lot was full. But thankfully, it wasn't that bad. But my store, their aisles, you can't fit, like, two carts down. And so when I'm trying to film, people are, like, trying to get through. And it was just, like, seriously. So I may or may not do my Walmart I bought a haul next week. It all depends. I might just take a break next week for being at uh, Christmas week, which is pretty nice. But we will see. Um, if there's any hot deals, I will definitely share with you guys if I can. But otherwise, I hope you guys have a nice holiday weekend. Uh, and a lot of you guys are celebrating Christmas this week, and we were going to, but I don't know. That's up in the air, but I hope you guys all have your nice weekend, and I will see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys all later. Bye-bye.